You're a Zaid. And you're a Nora. I can tell from your tone you've heard of me. Let me ease your mind. There seem to be wild stories about me among your tribe. But the Nora have me mistaken for someone else. I'm not sure where the fault lies, but the fog of war often breeds confusion. Unfortunately, some refuse to acknowledge the error. So it was with the last Nora who came through here. The last Nora who came through here. You mean Nikoa? Is that her name? Oh, well. It was a very unfortunate situation. She attacked me in broad daylight. If one of my men hadn't spotted her, I might well have been injured. But we were able to subdue her without harm. What did you do with her? I let her go, of course. It was clear she thought I was responsible for unspeakable things. So, in a sense, her actions were justifiable. I explained that she was wrong, then sent her on her way. Sadly, I don't think she believed me. Where is Nikoa now? I don't know exactly. She left raving that she would find a way to bring me down. But I did hear a report from the garrison at Lonesome Rock that a young woman had been abducted by bandits. Might have been her. So you deny participating in the Red Raids? No, I didn't say that. I did have a role in those operations, albeit a very limited one. But all this nonsense about torture and murder, that wasn't me. They had me confused with some other commander. I don't doubt some of my comrades did bad things, but Sun King of Ad has worked hard to eliminate such brutality. You've really gone out of your way to help, Prefect Said. It's no trouble. The Sun King wishes to make amends with your people, and I am his humble servant. I'll go to Lonesome Rock and get to the bottom of this. I promise you that. You do that. And if our men are anything less than helpful, please let me know.
some pain. We're dead too if you don't fight. This is gonna look real. Haven't you got anything better to do? One of the Karja soldiers fell here. The other soldiers must have retreated. But to where? Another Karja soldier. Did anyone survive? At least his death came quickly. be the helmet from the last Persia soldier. Someone nearly lost his head here and ran off. Save these for the trail. A machine dragged something into the water here. Maybe he made it to that island. I'm never really done. I brought See? down all the beasts, but I missed out on the feasts. I went to the beer fa- I wasn't expecting to be found, especially not by Nora. I wasn't expecting to find a half-clad Karjan soldier singing like a drunk. I apologize for my um, behavior. I thought I was dead. Come on. 
Your commander asked me to bring you back to Day Tower. I refuse to be led back to my outpost by Anora, like some prisoner. <sighs> Fine. Go by yourself. Wait. Look, I got in a tussle with a snap maw. It ate the half of me that was armor and bow. The thief is still in the water. I can't go back without a weapon. Find my bow, please. I'll get it. Just don't start singing again. Better watch out for that machine. It doesn't look friendly. Here's your bow. Good luck out there. Thank you. I, uh, I didn't want to die in foreign lands like my men. May the sun light their passing. I saw some of the places you'd been. The new settlers have no appreciation of craft. They'd already piled your work in a ditch. But I knew the signs to look for. The scrabble in the dirt, those surprised splashes. And I did tell you we'd meet again. No. Still hunting bandits? Oh, yes. I've been sharpening my blade, anticipating the scent of the fight. Don't get me wrong, these scum are odorous. A little panic and desperation really sets it off, though. Like an incense. So, what's your knife called? Why would someone name a knife? So much for small talk. Are you ready? Just don't think this means I enjoy it. Don't worry. We'll take your secret to their graves.
little easier. Seems like an ordinary outpost. I better look around. I'm so bored. I'm bored with being bored. I'm bored with you talking about being bored. I'm bored with you complaining about me being bored. I wasn't compl- Hold, Outlander! What are you doing here? Prefect Zaid told me that bandits abducted a girl near here. Do you know where they might have taken her? Zaid told you that, did he? Huh. No bandits around here, girl. But I think I can help you find your friend. The boss sent us a fresh one, boys. Wrap her up and tie her down. Eyes on me, Lars! No more! They're gonna wipe us out! Face the sun's uh. judgment! Uh. There are chains in the cart. Not just chains, manacles. They were moving prisoners somewhere. Maybe Nicole's inside. That Nora girl we got in the hole is nice and Sounds like Nicole is here, and I'm gonna have to cut through these guards to get to her.
prisoners. Chained up to be sold as slaves. Talk to Nokoa. She'll know what to do. Please, help us get out of here. Please, help us get out of here. Nakoa? Jan sent me. Look, we can talk more once we get everyone out of this pit. Jan sent you? I don't believe it. Well, I guess one of his prayers finally worked. I've got the key. I'll help the others. Let's go. I knew you were going to be trouble, girl. But you'll make it worth our while in the end. The end is now, Zaid. For you and your men. You gave him a quicker death than he deserved? My father was a hunter. He taught me every animal deserves a clean kill. How did Zaid come to run a ring of slavers? All the scum you just killed? They butchered for Zaid during the Red Raids. The new Sun King kicked them out of the army, but Zaid managed to lie his way out of trouble, then saw a new way to make a shard, putting his grunts to work here. How did Zaid capture you? I tried to get him at Day Tower, but he caught me, then let me go so he could have his men grab me later. And after? Said he was going to sell me into slavery like the other poor bastards that came through here week to week. But he took his time, and kicked me around whenever he stopped by. Guess me trying to kill him hurt his pride. What are you going to do now? The others were in that cellar for months. 
The more run down they got, the harder it was for Zayi to sell them. They need food, rest, and hope. I'll take them to Meridian and tend to them. You've been through a lot. I'm fine. Are you sure? Zaid's dead. I was ready to go through anything to make that happen. And I did. You're not even going to try to go back? What about Jan? The Matriarchs won't let me back. Even if they would, I wouldn't go. They can burn for all I care. As for Jan, I know a way to get word to him. I'll miss that runt. But at least he'll know I'm safe. Time for me to go. Look, I don't even know your story. It must be a good one if they gave you the mark of a seeker. If you ever feel like telling it, look me up in Meridian. I'll be there until the others get back up on their feet. Until then, thank you for helping me cut this rot from the world. I don't know. Maybe now I can put Zaid behind me and remember my father as I should. As soon as the others are ready, we'll head for Meridian. Thanks again for all your help. I thought... I thought we were dead. But Makoa never gave up hope. I can't believe we're free. Nicole was all that kept me going. 